Regrettably, Hicks has recently begun to improve his offensive production, recording two hits and a homer in his last seven at-bats. Welcome Yankee fans subscribe to the channel to receive the latest news from the Yankees. Veteran Aaron Hicks was forced to leave the game early after experiencing discomfort while rounding third base. Hicks didn't have too much time to relish in his latest contribution, though. As he scampered home from second base on an Anthony Rizzo RBI single, the outfielder felt a pang of discomfort in his left side. Replay showed an abnormal look on Hicks' face while rounding third, his pace disrupted ever so slightly as he jogged toward home plate. Hicks wasn't sure about the severity of his injury while speaking in the Yankees clubhouse after the game. Yankees manager Aaron Boone didn't have an update after the final out either. All we know as of Tuesday night is that the outfielder will be re-evaluated by team physician Christopher Ahmad on Wednesday morning to get a better idea of exactly what is going on. To say it's been an extremely rough year for Hicks is putting it lightly. Between the persistent and merciless boos from fans at Yankee Stadium and his ghastly numbers, he's slashing .153-.231-.220 in 24 games, there haven't been too many positives for the 33-year-old. Finally, he starts to produce for a few days and bang, he's in danger of missing time with an injury. I'm finally starting to slow the ball down, Hicks said in a dejected tone. I feel like my at-bats are starting to be a little bit more controlled. Definitely sucks to kind of go backwards. Isn't it easy for Aaron Hicks what you expect from the future of Hicks in the Yankees? Leave your opinion in the comments and until the next video.